when did you decide like, hey, or when did the opportunity actually come about for you to go over to uh, AEW? So, I mean, like when when the news for Ring of Honor broke, I feel like um, Malachi, Tom and I had already been discussing this House of Black dream scenario of like, what if and, you know, if it could happen and how to kind of get the wheels moving on that. And I think that we were already discussing, like, possibly trying to do, uh, like, PWG, like, trying to, like, set the groundwork for it. So it was very much, like, in the in the works already. And we had already been, you know, discussing, like, the, the what ifs and what we could do with it and, like, bouncing ideas off each other. But I talked to Tony very shortly after the news from Ring of, Ring of Honor broke and, uh, you know, he invited me out to a couple of the shows and we discussed things. And that's when the whole House of Black idea really came to fruition. And, you know, it seemed like a good fit and everything kind of fell into place. So I, I was very fortunate that, like, I kind of had a plan already and it just kind of was an easier decision. You know, there wasn't like, well, do I stay at Ring of Honor or do I go to AEW? Like, it was like, well, there's no more Ring of Honor, so here we go. It was one of those things where one door closes and another one opens. I think that's a perfect example of kind of what you went through a little bit. Yeah, and, and that's kind of how I've always lived my life is to not put all your eggs in one basket because, you know, some days that basket's not there. So you got to be able to feed yourself somehow.